Hi gang, next I want to show you how the index separation works in PixelSep. And it's actually probably one of the easiest things you've ever done and, and get a real good result. So I'm going to go ahead and hit uh, Filter and PixelSep. And just like the simulated process, there are two different ways to do the index separation in PixelSep. I'm going to go ahead and hit Color Separate. Uh, we have the preset index palettes, uh, just like most uh, separation software has. Um, I've added a couple things where I switched out a few colors so you'll uh, have some options there. And the other thing is the select index, which has its own dither uh, right here. And this will allow you to select the colors and adjust the dither amount. If you run the dither all the way to the end, you're going to get uh, what is pretty much going to amount to the simple spot palette. Uh, it's pretty much the same thing. This is as non dithered as it can possibly get. This will probably have a teeny bit of dither in it. Uh, but for the most part, I'm going to show you how to run this, and, it, and this is pretty much going to show you how to run both of these. But first, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to do one of these preset index palette. I'm going to choose this palette right here, six color with the green in it. And I'm going to choose the one with the green in it because of this right here. So go ahead and say, hit the six color, and you can see that all those colors are forced into a palette uh, that Pixel Set has set up. Now the separation is not actually done yet, just the index is done. So when I hit Set Editor, uh, what will happen is the whole thing will go through and make the channels and then make the separation edits uh, that we need for the channels. And I'll get out of this just to show you. And move the channels over so you can see that they're all here. And that you'll be able to see that there's all the separations. Uh, if I get rid of the green, then the green gets gone. If I get rid of the red, then the red gets gone. So you can see that that's how the uh, separations work. Now I'm going to get out of this and I'm going to show you how the um, user select works. So I'm going to go back to filter, pixel set, and I'm going to go to color separate and um, select index. And what this is is user select index. And we can go through and pick our own palette. We don't need to, to rely on the preset palettes. The preset palettes are great. Um, I, but I really prefer this uh, selecting colors thing. I've heard a lot of great feedback about this. I'm a big index guy, and uh, this really works really well. We can see that we have yellow, red, a blue of some sort. I'll use this Carolina blue, and uh, black and some green. And so I'll go ahead and hit the yellow. Now, when you hit index, uh, it's going to find everything that could possibly be a yellow until you add another color. I'm going to add a red. Now it's going to find all those colors. Now if I hit the black, you'll see that it'll start to trap colors inside. And I'll go ahead and hit the green. And we have our palette. Oh, I didn't hit the blue yet. Let me hit the blue. And now you can see that we have all the colors there. Let me back this out so you can see it. Now we have a five color palette. Um, plus base and highlight. Let me get into the step editor so you can actually see the steps. I'm going to go ahead and do yellow, and that'll get the get this up and running. Now, um, just for the sake of showing you how the base works in this, I'm going to make a black shirt, and I'm going to ixnay the highlight white and ixnay the white base, just so you can see. Now, of course, there's a white uh, background around here, so it doesn't really help my uh, my demo too much but you'll get the idea and I'll go ahead and hit that white base and just to show you um, what that base looks like it's a grayscale base there it is um, you can uh, saturate that more and I'll move back over here so you can see it and you can see it's a little darker here's the other thing you can do let um, me hit that yellow let's, let's hit the Carolina blue now let me find green. Um, let's say we want to put more of that in the base. I can actually say more in the base. And you can see that it's starting to uh, pump up the base in there. If I hit the red and it's the more in the base, it's going to start pumping that up. So it's a really, really helpful uh, tool, this, this uh, separation editor. And of course, uh, choke and spread, you know what that is. I'll show you later when I um, do a, a demo on this. 
But you get the idea. This is the index separations in Pixel 7, and it's really a handy, handy, handy tool. Let me get out of this so you can see the uh, channels themselves. Here's the, the base, and you can see that it pumped up the red, it pumped up the green in the base. And uh, there's a yellow, red, let me zoom on this so you can see it better. Here's a yellow, red, green, Carolina blue, and black. And all together they make this image right here. So anyway, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. More videos coming. Thanks again.